We're good. Hi, this is Chris Keon in the flesh, coming to you through the internet. You're watching my how-to series. Whether you're camping with a group of friends who just pitched a huge tent, or you're trying to stay warm to beg for money from suburban youths like me, you're gonna have to learn how to roll a sleeping bag. So, you're gonna have to watch this video. Here's the sleeping bag I'm gonna teach you with. I had to borrow it from my friend AJ because I hate camping. You go out in the middle of this fucking wilderness, there's lakes with mosquitoes in there and everything, you smell like shit, and then you hear this weird shifting noise outside of your tent, like, it sounds kind of like this noise, and the only person out there is your scoutmaster. You're like, what, what was that noise? And he's like, I don't know. I don't know. I heard it too, so I came out here naked. There's no fucking soap. How are you gonna wipe your- But, some people want to do it, so I'll teach you how to roll a sleeping bag. The first step is to unroll the sleeping bag, like so. Oh shit. What are those? Are those pills? I don't know, man. Do you think they're uppers or downers? I took downers one time. It was, it was some crazy times. My friend, he gave me two or three pills to put up my butt. So I, I shove them up there. We were drinking so much, too much. I blacked out. The last thing I remember is we were in a really dark room and I'm just going crazy. We were playing tackle football. It was so fun. A bunch of us guys. It was really hot though. We had to take some shirts off, you know, some socks off and shoes off. Oh, it reminds me of... Reminds me of high school playing tackle football with the good old boys. Hopping under the quarterback. Good times. So do you think they're uppers or downers, man? Uh, I, I wouldn't know. Come on, man. We gotta find out, right? <laughs> you're not you're not gonna take those, are you? Why not, man? Come on, you should take some with me. No, no, I'm good. Come on. No, Come on. Yo, no, bro. I think, no. I'm... Come on, man. We gotta find no, out, dude. Go on. No. Alright, man. Whatever. You be a wuss, right? I'm gonna start out with two. Yeah, I don't think two will be enough, man. I party a lot. Are you taking more pills? Yeah, man, you're not taking yours. Fuck it, man, I'm just gonna finish off this bag. All right, do you starting to fill something? No, man, I think they were duds. Why is my room so messy? I get every opportunity to clean it. I just have to give it to my mom. There's always a smell, you know? You just smell this thing. I have no idea. Oh, gosh, those people, you know? Dude, why are you filming right now, man? Why is there a camera in this room? Why are there so many teeth in my mouth? Why are you doing this? I'm just trying to clean my goddamn room. I'm, I'm over here, busting my balls. I gotta clean this. I gotta clean this. Is that how it usually spins? I mean, doesn't it usually go the other way? No, I, no, that's not right. And that speed and trajectory is all wrong. That's, the, oh my gosh. Once we buy up the Supreme Court, we can rule our actions constitutional. And then we'll have free reign of the military. We'll be controlling the mass media. We can draw up support, execute a scapegoat, enable martial law. We'll send out drones followed by the National Guard to kill any dissenters. And then we'll expand to Mexico and Canada, invade Europe in one fell swoop. We'll set off nuclear bombs in Asia and Africa. We'll take all the prisoners, send them to Australia. We'll start a reality show called Concentration Campers. All the kids will love it. We'll expand to the moon, paint the moon as our flag, and then we'll expand to other planets. We'll go to other galaxies, other planets with life forms, control them, rule them. The entire universe will be ours. This is the greatest idea ever. All we need is a substantial amount of capital to begin our government infiltration. Uh, I, are you fucking serious? Yeah, but first we need to make a withdrawal. Chris, I think you lost your mind. No, 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 no. I got it. It's like in that movie where you gotta rob a lot of different places, like a grocery store, because a diner would expect it. You can't rob a grocery store. I can with this gun. But where'd you get that gun? Don't worry about it, okay? I'll be in and out in under 30 minutes. Keep the car running. Ah, uh, shit. Here, what happened? What happened? Nothing. Don't worry about it. Go, 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 go. What? Oh, shit. I got in there. I showed her my gun. I pulled out my big dick like a boss. You know what I'm saying? And she was like, oh, shit. Gave me all that cash. Dollar, dollar bills. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, man? That bitch was giving me the crazy eyes. You know, the kind of like, oh, yeah, boy, jump on this. But I was like, shit, bitch, I need to get some money first. I come back. I come back. I buy some, buy some shit at your store. Give you a little wink. Ooh. One of the fucking customers, though, he started flipping out, you know? He was pissing his pants. I was freaking out. I shot him, and then I started strangling him. It was either him or me, and I was the one with the fucking gun. Congress, here we come! The cops are gonna find me. I know they're gonna well, find me. What do you mean they're gonna find you? I left my ID at the store. How could you left your ID? I was buying cigarettes because I was so stressed out about it. Did you hear that? It's, it's just something outside. No, it's not. Shit, the cops.